so many important stories in the world, things you really do need to know about. But tonight, we're beginning with a story that you will want to know about if you have a heart. It is a story of an eight-year-old boy from Austin who is inspiring others to look after each other. His name is Caleb Dundas, a second grader from Southgate Elementary. Now, his one act mm. may have saved his sister's life. ABC 6 News reporter Miguel Octavio spoke with Caleb and his family tonight. Miguel, what did he do? Laura and Ross, he donated bone marrow to his sister, Adelia. She's only nine years old and has MDS. It's a bone marrow cancer that can quickly develop into leukemia. Her parents say it's not as common among children, but her brother Caleb didn't hesitate to help her when he found out he was a match. Heroes don't always look like Superman. Thank you for everybody who has watched this video. I hope you like it. They might just be an <laughs> eight-year-old boy from Austin, Minnesota. So cold. I know that my class doesn't get recess. Caleb Dundas is a Vikings fan, a Mario Kart lover, and Adelia's younger brother. I don't think he ever really considered not not being the donor, that by doing this he could save his sister's life. Adelia has been undergoing treatment for MDS. Despite showing no symptoms, she was still diagnosed this past December. Nothing could prepare her parents for the news. The only treatment option was a transplant, and you know all of that was packed into about 30 seconds of conversation. The procedure needed a match, which can be rare, but Caleb always had a feeling he was the one. He was right. Mom and dad were speechless. Nothing you can do but just be praising God that there was a match. I think that really overwhelming fall to our knees, literally falling to our knees. But like everything else, this pandemic has made Adelia's recovery more challenging. The family can't take any risks for her health, so the community is stepping in. I just can't believe uh, the generosity of friends and strangers have not only written cards, but delivered groceries and meals. Caleb's selfless act is encouraging others to be heroes, even if he doesn't see himself as one. Heroes are just people who do what they have to do. He knows that he did something that's important, but he might not realize for many years just how, just how big of a deal it was. But his sister does and will always remember it. Caleb's surgery took place this past Thursday. Since then, Caleb has been recovering from that surgery, but he will be back to school tomorrow. Now, there are other people waiting for their matches. The parents are encouraging you to volunteer and see if you're someone else's match, just like Caleb was to Adelia. Chris, 